From the Linmar Technology and Communications Center, we are LMTV, Linmar Television. A total look at everything happening on your Linmar campus. Linmar, your news starts now. Good morning, Linmar. It's Thursday, March 24th, 2011. Here's the stories making news on your Linmar campus. Our top story, LMTV is taking the next steps into the future. Today for the Club Connection, Jordan Webster Moore explains. Jordan? I'm coming to you on a virtual set. It's just one of many exciting new changes coming to LM LMTV. We want to thank Intermec and your student council for making it happen. But that's not all. We are getting ready to cover many more events and add a whole lot more video to our newscasts. We need people to help us live stream vi video of sporting events from the new stadium. We need sports play-by-play -play announcers to join our team. If you enjoy shooting video and editing on the computer, we also need your help. You don't have to be an expert on all this stuff. We'll train you. Underclassmen, especially freshmen, are encouraged to apply. Just stop by a studio, room 201, any morning before school and talk to Mr. Fry. Juniors, if you want to be an anchor next year, applications are now available in the studio. Hurry, the deadline to turn them in is Friday, April 1st. And one more change, you can now follow LMTV on Twitter. We are tweeting important developments from across the campus. Check us out at LMTV News. Meg, back to you. Hold on, I gotta tweet that one. In other sports news, other news, have you bought your ticket for the variety show? Why not? See Mrs. Dayton as soon as possible. The show is Monday and Tuesday night at 6.30. Tickets are $6. There are no reserve seats, but it's much easier to get your tickets earlier as the lines are extremely long on the night of show. If you are attending Allstate Speech Monday at UNI, team members will leave from door 3 before school starts and not be back until after 5. Questions, see Mrs. Fry. We will, back with, we will be back with more LMTV news right after this. Texting is cool. <laughs> driving is cool. Texting and driving, not cool. Welcome Black. Glee is coming back to Iowa State and Limar Girls are invited. Glee stands for Girls Learning and Experiencing Engineering. It will take place April 2nd. Talk to Ms. Griswold to learn more. Now Caleb joins us with the morning sports. Caleb? In the wide world of Lindmar sports, anyone, planning, anyone playing baseball this year must order a team hat by April 8th. You can pick up a clothing order from the coach Lechner in room G139, the athletic office, or download one from the baseball website. Intramural dodgeball is set to begin. Register your eight-person team with Mr. Stryker in the, PE, in the boys' PE locker room. Hurry, the registration deadline is Tuesday, March 29th. A softball parent meeting is scheduled for Thursday, March 31st at 7 p.m. in the Upper Commons. This is for all parents of team members in grades 8 through 12. The players are not required to attend. That's sports. Back to you. In news from the counselors, attention juniors. The National Council on Youth Leadership is now taking nominations for next year. Drop by the guidance office for an application. Everything needs to be turned in by April 7th. See Mr. Chouette to learn more. Summer internship applications are due this Friday. Summer internships are worth five Limar credits and count towards the Echo 20 award. But most of all, summer internships can open your door to your future. Seniors, time is running out to apply for the Limar Foundation scholarships. They are due this Friday. If you have questions, take a look at the scholarship spreadsheet on the Counseling Department website. For more information on these stories, stop by the counseling office or check out their website. Now Scott joins us with the arts and clubs. Thanks, Meg. <coughs> on the Linmar arts and club scene, there are several members of the Aristocat cast who have not returned their CD or scripts. Please get those into Mrs. Fry as soon as possible. The newest club on campus, Interact, will meet th Tuesday morning at 7.45 in the food court. Everyone is welcome. See Mrs or Mr. Gentry in room H221 for more information. Help voice with Diversity Night. Sign up outside Mrs. Skelung's room, I-218. That's your club update, Meg. Back to you. Thanks, Scott. Today on Channel 1, 
a look at a look back at the life of the legendary actress Elizabeth Taylor. That's today at three on LMTV. Now Caleb joins us with lunch. Caleb, it's teri chicken teriyaki and rice with pea pods and pineapple tidbits with a fortune cookie to top it off. The other lines will offer sloppy Joe bar, pizza, or chef salads. That's lunch. Back to you. Now weathercaster Jordan Webstermore joins us today with today's forecast. Finally, a brighter day. My LMTV forecast calls for mostly sunny skies today with a high of 38. Tonight, it's going to be cold, so you're going to want to grab a jacket. We'll see more clouds and an overnight low of 24. And tomorrow, can you believe it, there's a 30% chance of snow with a high of 36. That's your forecast. Meg, back to you. Thanks, Jordan. That wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. Remember, LMTV is always available online. Just go to the high school website. For the entire cast and crew, thanks for watching. Join us again tomorrow and make it a great day, Lamar.